Hi friend, this is Dr. Apoor Mehra. I'm Dr. Zainab Bora. So Dr. Zainab is uh, the brain behind conceptual radiology. So as we call it, when we were in medical colleges, so we used to say class representative. <laughs> so that is what we call uh, conceptual radiology in short as CR. And actually in true word, it is a representative of conceptual in the true sense leading right from the front. Although it's not the first in the series, but the way it has been beautifully built over last two and a half months or so is really commendable the way Zainab is leading from the front. Uh, there are a few things Zainab I would like to ask you. When we talk about conceptual radiology versus other conceptuals, they had recorded lectures, but you thought about a daily life session which you are doing it beautifully with one of the best educators in the country. What was your thought of uh, developing conceptual radiology the way it is today? Sir, I always uh, look back to my residency period, you know, where I thought that there should be better academics, you know. But most of us, you know, in our residency have a time crunch. It's not like I can consume lectures at the rate that we used to do for NEET PG, you know, that was a whole different phase. In residency, it has to be consistent. The learning, the education is never ending, you know, there is no end point like a NEET PG entrance that, you know, this is what I, is the concise filtrate of what I need to know. Here the concept changes, the learning will continue lifelong and there is just no end. But, you know, what I thought that if it is consistent, if I can give you one lecture every day, one topic every day, it gives you that uh, satisfaction that you are learning along the way. And, you know, three years, if you do this, I think you are automatically ready for the exams. The exam preparation happens by default. So, so yes, the lectures are important topics for the exam but then we are doing it one day at a time so that it does not get overwhelming for anybody you have a target and even if there are backlogs there will be certain days where you're not or you are on call you can't see the lecture of that day you can still you know finish the backlogs so basically the whole idea was that it should not become overwhelming for a resident that content itna zada hai that i'm not able to finish it you know so we wanted to keep it uh, doable uh, as you've written so that that is uh, something which was the idea that nobody should get overwhelmed one video per day one topic per day and you have the next day if you do get time you know to uh, in the night while you are having some time in the day you can just read up on it read up on that topic and that gives you the closure that all right i'm finishing off topics for the exam also while i'm busy doing my residency work okay so what are the aspects that you're covering in conceptual reality? What all do you give there? So, sir, we have divided our content into uh, the core part, which is clinical radiology. So clinical radiology is where we are covering the important topics, which one, come as long answer questions in the theory exam and second, come as cases, you know. In practice, those are the most common cases that you encounter and in the exam, those are the most common long cases that you get. So that is what we are doing first, you know, and then what we have done, we've built up a great team wherein everybody is a subject specialist you know everybody is a specialist in certain department like we have fetal radiologists we have msk specialist we have ir specialists so the specialists are coming and taking these topics in detail you know so it works both way wherein i can come and supplement the information give you a bird's eye view that this is the topic this is how you write the answer this is how you approach the case you know so that is what gives you the exam prep and then we have specialists who are going to teach you all of those things in great detail detail in what they know the best you know so that is how this becomes an all encompassing uh, app for everybody you know not just for exam prep but even after that it's going to stay with you and help you out so that is uh, what we are doing apart from that we have core exam related uh, lectures we do case discussions with residents we do spotter quizzes we do dnb oski uh, you know model dnb oski sessions so this is something which is core exam prep apart from that there are physics lectures which now beautifully Dr. Nikita Nanwani is conducting, you know, so physics is one of the theory aspects, which is usually very tough, you know, I personally found it the toughest part of radiology because it is all theory and comes as a major part for the exam. So I think ma'am is doing a great job in, in simplifying this for the resident and making it more palatable. So that is uh, happening uh, side by side. We are also doing workstation demonstrations, wherein, you know, we are reading cases and teaching young residents how to approach the cases 
what will you see in a case what is the normal anatomy so that is what is happening and and you know soon we will have more content which is uploaded in all of these categories we are constantly trying to engage the residents more so this is the broad uh, structure that we have are you also in. putting the notes and the papers yes sir so simultaneously all of the lectures which are being conducted not just the pdf we are also having the lecture typed out and and you know the student making those notes so that it's easier for for the students to revise the lecture one and if they are asked a question on that it becomes very easy for them to frame the content you know so we have typed out notes in addition we have dnb solved papers also so again that serves as a reference of how you have to write your answers you know so so that is what we are doing and in addition what we are planning is to have mcq quiz is also you know topic wise so that students can practice mcqs we have frcr which is one of the exams that most radiologists in india are now attempting so we are going to venture into that as well and we have an frcr expert who's just joined us so we will venture more into that as well that is uh, something we've planned all right so uh, what i understand from here is anna that you'll make sure that the dream with which i thought of conceptual was very simple whenever i'll, I'll speak to somebody for any reference they will come out with a foreign author and they will tell me that this has been taken from that place but here uh, what i see is just two and a half months what i see is down the line as you will gradually see it building up this is going to be a name in the world where people will say anything that you need to know in radiology in the world go to conceptual radiology app open it up you will find it by the search button this is what is what i foresee in the future is it true yeah definitely so apart from the concepts the notes all the exam preparations but this is one thing that will have there once you go into your clinical practice your uh, journey as a radiologist you will be having this on your phone with a button whenever you want to revise it will be with you so this is what you foresee yes absolutely yeah. hopefully and uh, you are managing btr now you have a baby zara and then your third baby conceptual geology <laughs> and you're killing it all the three fronts right what i can just say is i wish that uh, you keep helping the students like this but how do you do it i have no idea i have no answer to that question I, it's it's just happening it's the responsibility sir basically that so many students before the app was launched you know you saw how the response was and and it's very overwhelming for us you know when you have so much faith without having an app in your phone you know you have trusted us at pre booking so now it is our responsibility to show up and you know deliver and and we are working really hard in order to uh, keep up to the expectations that you have from us yeah so all the best zena and remember this time you know uh, it is the radiologist who are listening to you yes so for uh, for you you know this is a different level of escalation you know and i can promise you that zena bora was not only rank 1 uh, for aims entrance exam she also topped her uh, md radio diagnosis at aims and she was a very sincere student that's why she's been able to build up this content and i can tell you she refers to the books she reads before she comes to the classes and she is closely watching everybody doing building this app so beautifully more power to you and more happiness to you all the very best thank you, you. Thank so you.